we are here today because we chose to be united. Less than two weeks ago, the state released a budget that ignored those demographic shifts in Illinois. It said that even though our state is becoming more diverse, even though the Latino population has grown more than 32% in the last 10 years, it said, this is what the budget said, that we should cut immigrant services by 74% statewide. Erie Neighborhood House is celebrating 141 years this year, and it's in our mission to serve immigrant working families just as we have done for 141 years. And it is just a travesty to think about the fact that we would not be able to do our mission any longer, as well as many other organizations across the state, if these cuts were to go through. These big cuts for small organizations means everything. So if we don't get the adequate funding, we're going to be completely out of business. We are asking for privileges. The only thing we're asking is for a fair budget for the immigrant communities. We aren't asking for any privilege. We just want a fair budget for our community. And I'm not only here as a state rep from the North Side, but also as co-chair of the Illinois Legislative Latino Caucus. We heard the governor's budget a couple weeks ago, and all of us were completely stunned because how can he cut funding for immigrant services and minority organizations and DHS organizations, when we are growing, our population is growing. We can't have that in the state. It is about unity. It's about everyone coming together from all branches of the city, state, the county, coming together to work for what? For a good cause for all of us to be together, to be united. I'm here to show my support. I choose to be part of the unity the, of, of elected officials to show that we are together. Together, why? Because the programming that services our community is vital. Vital for our community to continue um, with the kind of expansion that it is occurring. As, as a citizen and as an elected official, I'm going to continue to make it in the phone calls that I've made to Speaker Madigan's office and to the governor's office uh, to talk about the importance of these issues. And to me, bottom line, I've got some young kids at home myself, two sons. Uh, and I take a look at the future of Cook County, the city of Chicago, the state of Illinois, and the nation. Uh, and we owe those kids better. Also contact the rest of the state representatives, the rest of the state senators, and uh, the governor himself, and Speaker Manigan, uh, throwing my support for this, for this issue because it's very important. The, the fairness, the issue of justice, of uh, our population increasing and our resource diminishing just doesn't make sense.